It gets this hot. It's not only uncomfortable out there. It can be really dangerous too. And Chris Hoffman continues our team coverage and he says it doesn't take long for everyday surfaces to start baking. Surfaces like this tennis ball pickleball court, which some people are actually playing on, it can reach anywhere from we're seeing 120 upwards of 127 degrees. And that's why it's always recommended that you do have some something on your feet to really protect yourself. And that's why it's always recommended you watch out for your children and pets. Under this sun, it doesn't take long to heat up surfaces. It's hot and humid. Just take a look at this playground equipment. One swing was about 120 degrees. The other was more than 125. And then the matting, it was more than 140. It's hot, really hot. Which reinforces why you never leave children or pets in a turned off car. We turned off our news car and in 20 minutes, it was 156 degrees on this seat. That's just uh, too intense of a temperature to feel on the body. The National Weather Service says cars trap heat, so this speeds up the process of making it dangerous inside. That car can reach 120 to upwards 150 degrees inside the car within just a few minutes. Now, depending on where you live, the heat can hit differently as well. In an urban environment, there is more concrete that radiates the heat. It gives you that feeling that that sidewalk is just, you know, adding to the heat that air is already providing for you. But even plants in rural areas can up the moisture in the air, which in turn makes it feel hotter. So either side there can be some impacts just when we have this amount of heat this amount of humidity in the area so it's always recommended to have water wear loose clothing and just take it easy now with the shade it can feel cooler we did take our temperature gun to some shade and it saw anywhere of maybe about 80 to 85 degrees on the ground but it's a bit of a double-edged sword people at the national weather service say if there's enough moisture in the air you're still going to feel a little bit of that uncomfortableness and stickiness in monroeville chris hoffman KDK TV News.